Hello and welcome to the Mountain Bike Trivia Challenge. I'm your host, Christina Chapetta, and we've got four awesome downhill legends joining us today. We've got Danny Hart. Hey everyone, how are we all doing? Hope everybody's staying safe, looking after themselves and their family. We've also got Mr. Loic Bruni here. Hello everyone, I'm excited to try to beat Danny already, even though it's, uh, it's not a race. <laughs> I'm going to try. <laughs> Give these folks a competition and they'll battle it out for sure. Uh, Andrew Shandro, good to have you here as well. You have quite a lot of a wealth of knowledge, I would say. We'll see. Hi, everybody. Thanks for having us. I'm looking forward to seeing what I can do here. And then the other lady on board, we've also got Emily Siegenthaler. So good to see you. Hey, hey, guys. I'm excited to be with you guys and see, see other guys of the circuit as well. So we'll be missing you. How many riders have won more than 10 World Cups? Guess. Time! Answer is in three, two, one. Uh. Nobody got that question correct, surprisingly. The answer was 10, and those riders would be Gwyn, Menar, Pete, Vuyos, Hill, ACC, Atherton, Janier, Mosley, and GOV, which I'm sure I said most of those incorrectly. What? Oh. What nationality were the male and female winners of the first ever World Cup series? First ever World Cup series. And time. time. <laughs> That was a trick question. Ooh, uh, German. And answers. German for the ladies. German is the answer. Yeah. Emily's the only one on the board right now with one point. I one want to point. say that these are too hard. Sorry. This these is too hard. These are quite hard. Which rider called out Brendan Fairclaw for riding the Lusa track too early this season? Gossip. Mm, we're getting into the gossip. I did not make these questions. I don't. I don't. I don't think I know that. And time. I don't know that. <laughs> we're three questions in, and we're tied. Everybody's got one point on the board. So everyone remembers Aaron Gwynn's winning crazy chainless run from 2015 in Leah Gang, but who came second? Super famous run. Wow. Not sure. Time. Oh, good. Hey, Daddy. Oh, you don't even know how much. Connor, yeah, it was uh, times three. Sorry, Shando. You're that's a negative on that one. So. What what was the time difference with Conor Firon? Because I think it was super tight. Like, oh. I think it was plus zero zero four. Oh. That's not an extra point, by the way. That wasn't yeah, we question. don't give out bonus points here. <laughs> yeah, this my knowledge, man. Why was the 2002 World Cup at Grouse Mountain, British Columbia, cancelled? Wow. I can't believe I can't. What the hell? Time. I have no clue. Storm. Oh. oh, you're a little late to the party there, Corona Man. There were some really, really close answers there, but the only one that officially got that one correct would be Andrew Shandro. There was too much snow. How many World Cups did Rachel Atherton win in a row from 2015 to 2017? In a row. Time. I think I'm Danny, Danny, yeah. And the answer is 14. And the only person to get that correct was Emily. What? No that it's was a guess. That's, that's crazy. Two seasons. That's Danny and I together is 14. <laughs> <laughs> Both of you get a half a point. Well, half a point. 
How many World Cups were won on aluminum bikes in 2019, last season? How many How many World Cups are there again? Is it eight? Six. Eight? Six or six. Hey, they won a wiki. 25 World Cups. <laughs> How many races? And time. <laughs> Good guess. The answer is actually six. And the only person to get that one correct was Loic. Aluminum is back. It sure is. <laughs> this is a double double answer question. Who were the junior champions in 2019? Junior downhill World Cup champions. Perfect. And time. I didn't know how to spell his name. Yes. Confirmed. You all got the point. Woohoo! Sorry. Who was the highest placed Canadian rider in the World Cup overall at the end of last year? I thought that one's quite easy. Oh, that was easy. All right. Answers in three, two, one. Uh, good try, Loic, but uh, or no, Loic. but I, I didn't understand. I, I thought what place was the highest. I didn't know what name. Sorry. Oh. So that's why I said Marco. Marco, as in Mark. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that that counts. We're gonna take that. Well, you gotta let me have this. You owe me one, Loic. <laughs> Literally, for all the points here, two points, winner takes everything. What is everything? We don't know. Which rider's top 10 finish led to Sven Martin shaving off his eyebrows? No, poor Anka. Look at that. Did you say riders or rider? Which ride, like riders possessive, so. One person. Yeah. Answer then. Three, two, one. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Oh, everyone got it right. Good job. So we still do have a tiebreaker then. I would like to see a hard fought game of rock, paper, scissors. We're going to play best two out of three. How's that? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh my God, they're holding strong to the fist, the iron fist here. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, oh damn. damn. We've got our first lady downhiller. She won the game today. Good job, Emily. Woo! It's probably the only time I'll beat you in my life um, regarding <laughs> something category. with bikes, so. You never know, you never know. And in third place, tied for third place, Danny Hart and Andrew Chandra. Thank you so much, team, for playing with me today. That was actually hilarious, and you are all awesome contenders. Thanks for playing along. And thank you, as well, for joining our Mountain Bike Trivia Challenge. Want to flex your downhill brain? We have a fantasy league that anyone can compete in for some really sweet prizes. Hit the link in the description below for more info. 